One of the things that we're seeing is that it is really easy for anybody to build an agent, but it's very difficult for people to build a good agent that actually does quality work for the enterprise. Um, give you an example. Building a wrapper around GPT models, that's super easy. Being able to copy paste data to GPT and asking it to do what's called prompt engineering is one of the easiest things anybody can do. That, that takes all a couple of minutes to put together. But what you then get is for enterprises, their enterprise data is the most important thing that they have. And it's all about noise reduction because garbage in, garbage out. You can ask a GPT model or Claude or Mistral or Llama for any kind of question and it'll always come up with an answer. What I fear is that as enterprises embrace agents, they need to look at the quality of the agent. Does it have the appropriate reasoning? Was it built by people that come from that specific industry? Do the people that have built the agent, do they know that problem domain? Are they practitioners in that space? And the fear I have is as enterprises embrace these agents and they deploy these, what I'm just gonna call watered down agents or agents put together overnight by people that aren't really committed to that space, they'll try it and then they'll come back and say, AI doesn't work, LLMs don't work, it's a waste of time. So it's for us as part of this ecosystem to educate everybody to understand that LLMs are very capable, but pe people building enterprise agents need to be from that problem domain. I would never build a marketing agent because I have no idea what marketing really, uh, how that machiner machinery works. I would never build a pharmaceutical agent, but I'm building an IT agent over here because I understand this problem domain. And uh, I hope that people, when they deploy agents, are deploying them from industry practitioners.